Hello? I can hear you very well. You? Perfect. Oh. Perfect. We too. Uh, we, uh, it's, I'm really sad you can't uh, see us because uh, even with the COVID restriction, we have registered a sold out this night for the screening sold out. of the dolphin. Wow. Yeah, exactly. The, 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 there are really many people here for the screening of the Dolphin oh, okay. Man. So <laughs> okay. thank you very much uh, for well. joining us for this uh, screening. And for uh, the screening is about to uh, begin in a few minutes. Okay. Okay. So uh, I guess it's better for me just to shut up as soon as possible and just uh, let you tell us something about this uh, wonderful movie. You, uh, uh, you did. Uh, you want me to open please? my camera? Yeah, it's better for us so we can see you on the big screen. Okay, it would be wait. perfect. I'm sorry you can't see us, but wait, wait. It would be a, a pleasure. So I can see a face. Okay, here I am. Perfect. We can see you right now, very okay. on the big screen. Okay. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> so uh, as I was. Tell me before, uh, the screening is about to begin, so I guess it's better for me just to shut up as soon as possible okay. and just uh, let you tell us something about the Dolphin Man. Uh, I guess uh, the how first... Long? And, uh, what, how sorry? Do, how long do you want me to speak? Ah, uh, well, well, whenever you want, it's, uh, there is no problem. Okay. Uh, maybe tell us something about uh, how you get in touch with the story of Jacques uh, and why did you decide just to bring it on the big screen because it is a really fascinating and strange story for some aspects. Okay, I will, whenever you tell me. <laughs> so if you want to share with us how the project began in the first place, uh, how did you get to uh, uh, to get to know the story of Jacques and why did you decide to develop a movie on it? Um, so now everybody can hear me. Yeah, exactly. And <laughs> okay. even can see you Hello. on the big screen. Okay. okay. <laughs> Hello, guys. I cannot see you, but you can see me and I cannot hear you, but you can hear me. So uh, thank you very much for um, a sold out evening, uh, as I'm told. Um, I'm very honored to, you know, have the Dolphin Man screened in, in Italy. Um, this is a story that uh, took about uh, two and a half years of my life. I was asked to direct, um, meaning that it is not my own idea, but it became sort of an obsession for me for, for the two, two to three years that, you know, um, I was asked to make this movie, I think. The personality of Jacques Mayol is 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 really uh, a personality of opposites. Um, you know, on the one hand, Jacques Mayol was a great person. He was one of the first people to talk about ecological subjects. He was uh, in love with animals and nature. He he used to believe, as you will see in the movie, that if people, if human beings, didn't exist uh, on Earth, um, you know, Earth would be much better. He was sort of a misanthropist, you know. So on, on the one hand, he was a very, you know, he was an amazing person with the sea and with nature. But on the other hand, he was sort of a, um, like many great people, you know, he was he had a big ego and um, he he fought with with people and, and, and with life. And I do feel that he felt much better when he, you know, dived under the sea than when... Um, you know, he was he was with with other people and this happened, you know, towards his whole life. He was like this until the very end. I think it is very sad that, uh, you know, he died alone because he did die alone. He didn't really have, you know, his family was away. Uh, his friends were away, um, as you will see in the film, um, which is kind of sad. But I on the other hand, I think he had a marvelous life. He, you know, he, very exciting. Um, you know, he broke the 100-meter record. He was a, a scientist. He did a lot of science, uh, you know, projects about the human body and what happens to the human body when we dive under the water, you know, into the deep sea. Uh, so, you know, in a way, he's, he's, he's a multifaceted persona. He has many, many different layers. Now, um, as you will see, the film is also multi-layered because... On the one hand, it is a biography of Jacques Mayol, but on the other hand, it is a, a philosophical film. It is a film about yoga. Um, it is a film about nature and ecology. It is a film about dolphins. 
So, you know, there's many layers that we decided to, um, you know, bring uh, in in the film. And uh, as uh, we were sorry, writing... sorry, sorry if I interrupt you, Lefter, is uh, yeah. I'm going to translate really be briefly what you have oh, said. Sorry, so you're maybe someone. I'm so sorry. No, no, but there's no problem. There's no problem. Just one minute so I can maybe. Okay. You know, of course, of course, of course. Uh, così. Se è necessario, perché poi magari mi dite che tutti capite perfettamente, allora invece faccio molto brevemente, dice che è molto contento di questo sold out, è molto contento che il film sia arrivato in Italia e in generale è un progetto a cui tiene molto, per cui ha lavorato per più tra due o tre anni ed è stata quasi una vera e propria ossessione nei confronti di una persona, di un personaggio come Jacques Maillol che reputa assolutamente straordinario e che per tanti aspetti è una figura molto stratificata, eh, tanto per che è stata una delle prime persone effettivamente ad affrontare il tema, anche un tema in qualche modo ecologico, ambientale, in una maniera inedita e anche umana, e che in qualche modo l'ha portato anche a sviluppare una personalità quasi misantropa, verrebbe da dire, per cui preferiva quasi stare in fondo al mare piuttosto che con tutti gli altri esseri eh, umani, e che in qualche modo quindi è uno di quelli che ha anticipato un po' la frase «Se l'essere umano si dovesse estinguere staremmo tutti molto meglio». Eh, e al contempo è una storia in qualche modo molto ricca e molto triste perché Jacques poi è morto in solitudine lontano dagli amici, lontano dai propri cari e di conseguenza c'è anche una dimensione in qualche modo molto malinconica all'interno della storia che però allo stesso tempo è un film stratificato come il personaggio di Jacques Mayol soprattutto perché eh, è in qualche modo anche una riflessione filosofica sul rapporto fra corpo e mente e in generale quindi sul nostro eh, rapporto con la terra Perfect. I've finished the, the first part of the translation, so if you want to continue, please. Um, I mean, you know, the, I, I, you know, I don't want to take too much of, of everybody's time uh, because, you know, I, I, they should enjoy the film. Um, it, it was, a, it was a, a, a difficult but very adventurous film to direct. We traveled a lot, as you will see, there's a lot of traveling because Jacques Maillol traveled a lot. So we went to the Bahamas, to the United States, to Japan, to India to Bali, I mean, many, many, many places around the world. And um, of course, Italy was a big part, you know, I mean, he, you know, Maiol ended his life at the uh, L'Isola d'Elba. And um, uh, so we went there, you know, we visited his son who lives, uh, you know, in, in, in Elba. His daughter lives in, in Florida, in, in Miami. Um, And the personal aspect of the story is also very important, as you will see. You know, the, the Zach Mayola is a family man. Uh, I don't think he did very well <laughs> as a family man. But anyway, so um, let me not take up a lot of your time. Thank you very, very much for having me. And I, I do hope you enjoy the film. And, uh, you know, maybe you can send me some of, you know, what people said about the film. Perfect, really. <laughs> It would be a pleasure. Thank you very much, Lefteris. You were really strict that it was perfect as an introduction to the movie. I just like to ask you this thing. Uh, yes. what, what would be a suggestion for the spectators to enjoy uh, in the best way the movie right now for you? Oh, I think they, they will enjoy the sea, definitely. It's, it's, it's a movie about the sea more than anything else. And, and we traveled to many different seas. So I think they will enjoy the deep diving and the blue of the sea. The opening, you see the, the, the first seconds of the movie are right inside the sea. And uh, uh, I, I think in the end, uh, this is what stays with you when you leave. Perfect. Thank you very much, Lefter. It's, uh, You're welcome. Hope to see you soon again, Thank maybe you. in Flesh and Bones the next absolutely, time. Absolutely, absolutely. Have a nice screening. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your time. Good night. Hey.